to be prepared, of course. Go. Shepard, come in. Go ahead. Still trying to raise the Primark, but we've got trouble back here at the main barricade. If the Reapers breach it, we're done. Yeah. On my way. Let's move. Let's move. Let's see, let's turn the way up. Yeah, here. Garrus didn't have heard about that. I mean, he's been in all three games now, and he hasn't even once heard the expression like fish in a barrel. fight. Talk and roll. <laughs> I'm gonna beat the crap out of that ear. Woof. Run, 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 run. course will do. Jeez. How's your military holding up? 
Look around. That should give you some idea. You're putting up a good fight. For now. But how long does it take before the fight's kicked out? If they'd only listened to your warnings about the Reapers, we might have been ready. Maybe. Hard to figure how you prepare for something like this. Of course, the Normandies are uh, joint uh, Earth Alliance and uh, uh, Turian uh, technology. Oh, shit, I hate those things. And New York is crawling with the creepy bastards. <laughs> uh, I never should have left Earth. <laughs> gonna be bad all over. Leaving the fight just pisses me off. But you're here asking Victus to do the same thing. Leave the fight to make nice in some boardroom. This summit is the only chance we've got. None of us is beating the Reapers alone. We got a Soldier, you okay? Yes, sir. We'll make it. Have you seen General Victus? An hour ago. Okay, good luck. Yes, sir. Spare ammo. Commander, how many troops in that crash? 50? 75? Not sure. Sounds right. Hard to see a beautiful ship like that go down. Not to mention the men serving on her. Yeah. Yeah. We should go. They said the Primarch was headed south. Yeah, like I said in uh, one of my previous videos, that um, I'm gonna do a separate videos with all codexes, so you can read them um, and get some more lore, um, if you're interested, of course. So. I believe I have. 
Run! Run! Dude, run! Star she blows! Yeah. We're gonna take out those cannibals as quick as possible. Whoa! Jeez, what the hell? Another brute. Are you freaking kidding me? Well, I better run for it. I said I better run for it. Thank you. Whoa, what the hell did. Get away from there, James. Get the frick away from there, you piece of. That looks like something I'm gonna save. I gotta save that. I'm gonna take out the Bruce with that one. There's the first marauder, I mean, brute. I, I said pick it up. Holy crap. Better get the hell out of here. Whoa! I have one shot left. I have no ammo, what's so freaking ever? Why can't I pick... Where the hell is that... Special gun that I had a moment ago? I know I'm out of ammo... Ammo... for comfort. I need more ammo. I need more ammo. I need more ammo. On those stairs, let's go! <laughs> Boom! Uh, I guess. There we go. <sighs> God, those brutes.
The Turian is still fine in one direction. Why? I mean, there's nothing here except me. What the? F unit on the right flank. I believe your exact words were, get that thing the hell off my neck. <laughs> Appreciate it. General, you're needed off planet. I've come to get you. It will take something beyond important for me to leave my men or my Turian brothers and sisters in their fight. Fedorian was killed. You're the new Primarch. You're needed immediately to chair a summit and represent your people in the fight against the Reapers. is deceptive to make you seem reckless when you're anything but. War is your resume. At a time like this, we need leaders who've been through that hell. I like that. You're right. And honestly, uniting these races may take as much strength as facing the Reapers. See this devastation, Primarch? Double that for Earth. I need an alliance. I need the Turian fleet. Give me a moment to say goodbye to my men. Without him down here, there's a good chance we lose this move. Without him up there, there's a good chance we lose everything. Look at that. And they want my opinion on how to stop it? Failed C-Sec officer, vigilante, and I'm their expert advisor? Think you can win this thing, Shepard? Yeah, I don't know, Garrus. But I'm sure as hell gonna give it my best shot. I'm damn sure nobody else can do it. For whatever it's worth, I'm with you. What the hell? Welcome aboard. Are you ready, Primarch Victus? One thing. Commander, I appreciate your need for our fleets, but I can't spare them. Not while my world is burning. But if the pressure could be taken off Palavan. That's a pretty tall order. We need the Krogan. I can't see us winning this thing without them. Get them to help us, and then we can help you. The Krogan. Looks like your summit just got a lot more interesting. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what to say, tit for tat. Commander, but your plan feels doomed to failure. We know. We've been there before. But, Madam Counselor, let me... I'm not the only one that feels this way. The Salarian Dalatras is livid. Some of these issues are hundreds of years old. Time to let go. Perhaps. Still, we can't help but feel that this summit is a waste of your time. And we can't afford to have it waste ours. We must focus our attention on the arrival of the Reapers. So, no, the Asari will not be at your summit. Our lines would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. Good luck, Commander. And goodbye. And screw you too. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on Midcom. Admiral? Commander, have you retrieved the Primarch for your summit? Yes, sir. But the Asari are staying on the sidelines. They'll regret that. The time for unity is now. The Salarians will be there, though. You don't sound very optimistic. We expect the Krogan will be joining us too. 
I see. Well, then you've got your hands full, Commander. Was there something else you needed to discuss? Uh... Have you pieced together how the Reapers hit Earth? It wasn't all that complicated, really. They searched through the relays and hit Archura's station before we knew what was happening. From there, it was a short jump to the Sol system. Earth didn't stand a chance. Sending us to the Mars Archives was a good call. Still doesn't make up for the fact that the Reapers nailed us to the wall. I sacrificed the entire second fleet to provide cover for the third and the fifth to retreat. Hell, I presided over the most devastating military defeat in human history. How do you see us winning this war, Admiral? By making you the tip of the spear. I'm flattered, but the Normandy's just one ship. And a fast one. You can move quickly, hit a target, and leave before the enemy has time to react. It's an advantage, but can it win a war? It's the larger principle that matters. We'll never defeat the Reapers in a full frontal assault, Shepard. So I'll find their soft spots, avoid them where they're strong, and hit them where they're not. And when I find gaps in the armor, I'll hammer them with every soldier's ship and bullet we've got. How long can we keep that up? As long as it takes. The reality is, Shepard, everything I'm doing is a delaying action for you. I'm buying us time, keeping us in the game while you gather what we need for this Prothean device. So keep at it. Any updates on Cerberus? There's still the wild card here. Hitting the Archives on Mars suggests they're after the same thing we are. A way to defeat the Reapers. The elusive man implied as much. You'd think we'd be on the same side, now more than ever. Cerberus has never played by the rules as we know them. I don't know what their agenda is, but it has nothing to do with humanity's best interests. The elusive man talked about controlling the Reapers. He seemed to think that's how we win this. He's wrong. Dead Reapers are how we win this. Doesn't mean he won't try. I saw your report on that Cerberus soldier you found on Mars. If the elusive man is good at one thing, it's finding new ways to subvert science. It's never worked for him before, and it won't now. Well, that's it for now. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. I kind of like Admiral Hackett because 12,500 credits, so we got an extra two and a half thousand credits. Crucibles. Protean data files. These protean disks were found years ago on Eden Prime, recovered a few months before the discovery of the Prothean Beacon in 2183. For years the data on the disk was incomprehensible until the crucible blueprints provided the key to understanding the equation. Locked inside the disk were theories on dark matter meant to be used with the crucible main power source. Huh. Well we better get some more. Garrus. No, that's Victus. Sorry. Commander, thank you for allowing me the use of your ship, and for going along with this plan. Garrus said he had to attend to the Normandy's weapon systems. Something about calibrations. Sounds like Garrus. Yep. I'm sorry to say the Asari Counselor won't be joining us. She thinks there's too much bad blood with the Krogan. She may be right, but there'll be a lot more blood. Real blood, if we don't try. When you put it that way, the sooner we have this summit, the sooner we'll know. Is there something else I can help you with? How are things on Palavin? The casualty reports are staggering. The Reapers are using our own tactics against us. Destroy the enemy with overwhelming force. I've seen the same on Earth. The strategist in me admires their brutality. The Turian in me knows I'm watching the destruction of 15,000 years of civilization. My civilization. How is it being the Primarch? Not what I imagined. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away. 
Reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be Sorry? with my men. So there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I understand. Oh, God damn. Leaving Earth to save it. It's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of you. You never asked to be a leader. Yet your people will die if you refuse. We find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. Yeah. Thank you, Primarch. My thoughts are with Paladin. And mine with Earth. Well, at least we get some more people in the war room. Commander, what? EDD just went offline. What the? What do you mean, offline? I don't know. She's not responding, and I can't access the AI core diagnostics. You better get down to deck three. And we better. Comm systems are going haywire. Whatever's happening is centered on deck three. I'm guessing that's the uh, Prothean, what should we call it, that uh, woman we've, um, yeah, that's not where I'm supposed to go, oh. Jesus man, get it together, you better run. Joe, what's that sound? Fire extinguishers, Commander. Could be an electrical fire or something. I'm going in. Edie, talk to me. Is there a particular topic you wish to discuss, Shepard? What? Edie? Yes. You're in Dr. Eva's body. Not all of me, but I have control of it. It was not a seamless transition. A transition? You blacked out on us for a while there. Correct. When we brought this unit on board, I began a background process to search for its information on the Prothean device. This eventually triggered a trap. A backup power source and CPU activated, and the unit attempted physical confrontation. Fortunately, I was able to gain root access and repurpose it as I saw fit. During this process, it struggled. Thus, the fire. Edie, you need to alert us about incidents like this. You shouldn't have done this alone. Bringing the crew up to speed would have been counterproductive. All attempts to help would have been limited by reaction time. So if you're in there, are you still in the ship? I exist primarily within the ship. For optimal control, this unit should remain within Normandy's broadcast or tight beam range. Are you planning to take that body somewhere? Normandy's weaponry is not suited to every combat situation. This platform could provide limited fire ground support. You mean you could come with us? Correct. This body could accompany you to areas the Normandy cannot reach. Before we do that, I need you to guarantee this mech doesn't have any more surprises in it. Run whatever test you can. Then we can talk about using it in combat situations. One moment. I am running trials. Complete. I can send you a full report if you wish. However, my first step should be restoring the functionality to the Normandy to reassure the crew that all is normal. Just don't be surprised if the crew is a little wary of your new body. It was shooting at them a little while ago. An excellent point. I will take it to the bridge. Joker will also want to see it. <laughs> On that, we can agree. <laughs> nice. Okay, so new codex updated. Oh my god, how many hours now? I'm close to four hours of gameplay. And I'm guessing I'm really low on disk space anytime soon. And I have one hell of a long waiting for the 
each of the episodes to be completed, so... You're Her. positive you don't want to come over and talk? No, the gun battery is nice and quiet. If I throw down some rugs, it'll get downright cozy. Garrus? I'll be fine, Leora. Just gathering some thoughts. All right. Ooh. Hot. <sighs> Remains of Reaper Destroyer open. Store discount bonus. Discount bonus. Power cooldown bonus. Scan the remains of for new technology. Accept. And that's it. Okay. Well, you know what, guys? I'm gonna end it here. I have a long day tomorrow with uh, rendering and all that with Windows Movie Maker. And I make gotta make sure I don't. I think it'll take between three and four hours to render a half-hour video to get it as good. Uh, quality as I can get it so make sure you hit the subscribe button if you want to continue to join noob sea shepherd on this quest for revenge and hitting back on the reapers like there's no tomorrow and uh, save here let's have a look ah I gotta yeah <coughs> I have some uh, upgrades here. I'm gonna do fitness and what else do we have? Melee damage or health and shield damage uh, bonus. Increased health and shield bonus by 15%. That'll cost me four upgrades. Combat mastery expand. I have three ranks on combat mastery. I can do weapon damage bonus, or reputation bonus. Increase reputation bonus by eight percent. Increase your power duration by twenty-five percent. Okay, what else we got? Incendiary ammo. Increase health and armor damage bonuses by four percent. Increase health and armor damage bonus by 4%. Yes! That's how it's done. And that'll cost me 3 upgrades. Um, adrenaline Rush. Would be nice to have Incendiary Disruptor Ammo. That's mostly for shields and barriers. This one is for armor. And this one is for barriers. Oh. Well, you know what? I'm gonna go for the disruptor ammo. Upgrade. So there you have it. Save game. I oh, haven't saved since Citadel. So ah, save game. Yes, please. Save game saved. Okay, save game, game, game saved. So, thank you for now. And like I said, if you want to, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. That would be deeply appreciative. And uh, I might be getting back to some more Minecraft uh, gameplay later on to complete the glass. Uh, sea floor uh, that I was supposed to make on my little village there and also complete the house the cliff house uh, as I call it when that time arrives so for four and a half hours with gameplay I'm satisfied with this so thank you guys for watching and until next time until then good night sleep tight and don't let the reapers bite <laughs> Thanks for now.